I'll say a few things just to sort of set the scene first. Um, what is all this power efficient scheduling actually about? There's been a number of patches proposed over the last year or so. Um, this is a very rough timeline and it's probably incorrect in many places of what has happened. <clears throat> There's been, um, over the last year, Paul Turner's load tracking patches have been, been included in mainline. Um, we have had some, some work on on uh, packing tasks as a part of the, the, the scheduling policy done by both Vincent and uh, Alex Xi. And we have had other patches work looking at how to use uh, track load as a part of the, the, the general load balancing. I've been toying around with how can we implement um, support for asymmetric heterogeneous systems. Think of big little like systems. Um, these are all the blue ones. And common for all of those is that they haven't really made it anywhere. They got posted, discussed a bit, and then we didn't really go in further. Um, the only things that we have in mainline right now is Paul Turner's load tracking. And there has been a few changes lately to actually start to use load, the track load as a part of the load balancing logic. Um, and a while ago, there was a very interesting email from uh, one of the maintainers, Ingo. Um, saying, what is this all about? We, we see random patches and there is no real direction to it. So the point of this microconference is really to discuss how do we co coordinate all this and, and align all the work and make sure we all pull in the same direction. Um, the patches that have been posted doesn't really cover all, all the topics that, that have been discussed around power wire scheduling. Um, it's not just scheduling, it's actually a number of things. It includes things like task packing, which is scheduling, making scheduling and other power management frameworks aware of the power topology, which is missing in, in, in some of them as it is today. Um, and other things like thermal management, uh, better CPU idle, better CPU frag, support for big little like systems. Um, and what's really interesting is that most of these solutions or topics that I've put here, um, they cannot really be considered in isolation. If you want to fix a, one of the problems like packing, you need to consider a number of these. So all of the, all of the work that is going on will somehow affect the rest. So it's really important that, that, uh, that we agree on, on, on the way to go because if we work on them in isolation, they will conflict when we try to merge it all together. Um, so, in short, the mission for today is to, is to discuss all this work that's going on, try to, to find a solution that we can all agree upon. I'm pretty sure we won't reach agreement or we won't fix all the problems today, but at least we can get started. Um, the presentations today will be done by Vincent from Linaro, and we'll have another presentation by Daniel Altuka. Paul McKenney will talk, and I will sum up some stuff at the end. So I encourage you to really participate in, in, the, in the discussions today, um, and hopefully it won't be just one-way communication. I, I really hope that, that we can get something out of it. So thank you all for coming. <laughs>